If you are a six-figure coach or entrepreneur and you're dealing with overwork, burnout, or just feeling exhausted from how much work you just have to do to keep the business running, then this video is going to be for you. This is going to be exceptional because we're going to talk about how you can overcome overwork so that you may scale your business to seven figures and become a millionaire and get closer to your big, big, big vision of impact and income. And I invite you to watch this video until the end because I want to invite you to my free seven day challenge where you will learn how to scale your business with a lot more ease and simplicity. So let's dive straight into it. Hi, my name is Bogdan and I help coaches and entrepreneurs exponentially increase their income and impact by mastering the business owner mindset. In other words, by making freedom systems that allow you to do more of what you love and an exceptional team that grows the business even when you're not there. Now let's cut to the chase. Here are the three things that you need to get rid of overwork and just enjoy more of what life has to offer. Maybe you want to spend more time with your family. Maybe you want more time to travel. Maybe you just want to sit and relax and just do nothing for a change instead of just consistently and constantly working on the business. These three principles are going to make life so much easier for you. And the number one principle, the number one tool that you want to think about and create is a list. Make a list of all the things, the people and the activities that drain you of energy that literally make you exhausted and also make a list of people, things and activities that give you energy that after you're doing that thing where you're talking with that person, you just feel a lot more energized. And you know what I mean when you have those clients that you spend some time helping them, but at the end you just feel drained. And on the other hand, you have these clients where you absolutely loved working with. And by the end of the conversation, you just feel energized. You feel really good about yourself. You feel really happy. Do that, make those two lists because that's going to make it so much easier for you to understand what you need to do more of and what you kind of need to get rid of. And here's what I mean when I say get rid of it. This is principle number two. Think of ways of delegating and automating the activities that you need to do that you don't like that are draining you of energy. but. Unfortunately, they're necessary to grow the business, take things to the next level. Think of ways to give those activities to people that will actually feel energized by doing those specific activities. Now, that doesn't mean that you're going to find the exact person or the exact way to automate instantly. You might, but it also might take a few weeks or a few months to find the right person and the right automation system. But by you thinking about a few ways that you could do that, you're much more likely to eliminate these things that are draining you of energy and just, you know, causing you to feel exhausted all the time. And number three, this principle is so essential and so many business owners and coaches really, really overlook this. If you are doing well, if you're making some money, if you have overcame this idea of working hard, like if working hard comes natural to you right now, Literally the best thing that you can do for your business is to allocate time to do nothing. And I actually had a very deep and powerful conversation with one of my clients in that sense. You are a high performer and what got you here will not get you there. You've learned how to work hard. Now it's about really spending time to think and as a high performer, one insight for you can literally mean millions and millions of dollars. You don't need to be consistently working. You need to act and think like a business owner. And one of the jobs of the business owner is to step back, look at the business as a whole and think of ways of improving things, find different ways of doing things, find ways to optimize what you're doing, get more with less effort, with less resources. And literally you doing nothing and just spending time in nature, 
just uh, doing more of the things that relax you and help you enjoy more of life will actually open up the gates for more ideas and more inspiration and more insights. They're just going to optimize everything that you're doing and that will translate into millions and millions and millions of dollars. In other words, one or two hours spent just thinking and looking at the business is going to be so much more valuable than one or two hours of you working. So if you're watching this video, if you're already making six figures, it literally means that you are at this stage where the only way that you're going to grow the business is by actually working less. So have fun with that. Now, these are my three tips. If you enjoyed this, if you found this video insightful, go ahead, give this video a like and absolutely subscribe for more ideas for more insights and more tools on how you can grow your business exponentially. If you want to dive deeper, if you want to learn more about overcoming subconscious money blocks and dealing with imposter syndrome, letting go of perfectionism, if you want to get more detailed in terms of building an exceptional team that grows the business even when you're not there so that you enjoy more of life and you allow your team to show up as their best selves then this seven day challenge, this free seven day challenge is for you. Go down to the description, book your seat and don't wait. I mean, do it now because soon the content of this seven day challenge will be transformed into a paid course. So it's not going to be free for long. Go ahead, book your seat and I will see you soon.